Okay guys, welcome back. Don't mind the outside noise. The window's open, it's nice out, and there's traffic. Okay, grab a snack, grab a drink, because this is going to be a long haul. I have not been Dollar Tree hauling for a long time. But, I went the other day for some more storage bins. Don't come for me. I can't find mine, and I need some now for each kid's room. Okay. <laughs> So I went for some storage bins. Um, clear ones for myself. Ugh. Ugh. Let's on the back. Oh, there's stuff in there. Oh, hold on. So I got clear ones for myself. Then I got pink. Is that the lids? Yeah, that's the lids. I got pink, turquoise, and blue. So the kids can each have their own color. We're currently turning the playroom into Allie's room so they can each have their own room because her and Jack sharing that tiny room is not working. And the play having a playroom is not working because there's just, we can't keep anything straight. So, I think I had three clear, three pink, three teal, and three blue. So there's those. Get those out of the way. And then we have all these boxes over here. What are bags? Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bags. Plus, I've gotten multiple jugs of juice, but they're downstairs. I don't need to call the juice. You guys know what juice I get from Dollar Tree. All right, I'm already sweating. So, <laughs> taking off my sweatshirt. It is Mother's Day. I spent the morning with my kids and then Adri went to my mom's like for the afternoon and Jay has the little ones with him at his mom's. So they're seeing their grandmas for Mother's Day and I am enjoying a day of not having to change diapers or white booties or make food. Well, I did get them up and dressed and fed before they left. But all I went for Mother's Day was just a day to relax. So if you want to see how my morning went, check out that video, my Mother's Day vlog, because it was great this morning. I have the best kids ever. All right, so now into the Dollar Tree haul. I'm filming a bunch of hauls while they're gone, so stay tuned for that. See, yeah. We'll just jump right into this first bag. So I went in for the bins, and I saw they had all this cute summer stuff out, so I had to get... I mean, we're in a new house. I'm not going to put nails in the walls all ever, but we can still use command hooks like I did my other house, because having, like, decorations everywhere just made it feel so homey. And, like, here... We have nothing hanging on the walls, really. Um, and I'm ready to change that. And I'm ready to decorate my tiered trays and get some decor out. So, yeah. So, I bought some home decor type items. So, I found this cute little sign that says, Two Less Fish in the Sea. How cute is that with the little, like, mirror fish? So, I think that is adorable. So, I got that sign. So let me get the signs out of the way. And then I saw these. It's like the rope and it just says welcome and it has a sand dollar. How cute is that? It looks like it's on like the beech wood. Look how cute. And it says welcome. So cute. I love that. And then there's this one. They had a couple. I mean, I didn't get all of them. Then there's this one that says seize the day. And it has a seashell and it has like the mint teal color. Now people are doing yard work. Come on now. And it's like made, it looks like a rope. See how cute that is? All right, well, I can't wait till the whole neighborhood's silent because then I would never be able to film. So, sorry for the outside noise. It is what it is. Next up, they had this cute little sign. It says, the beach is calling and I must go. I love the beach. Like, I don't get there near, as no, near enough as I would like to. But I love the beach. Love the beach. Whether it's at the lake or Florida or wherever. So I got this cute sign. It's like the, the beach part is the galvanized metal. How cute is that? So I got that sign. There's this little sign for like on a tiered tray. It says, let the sea set you free. And it has like fish on it and a sand dollar. How cute is that? Look. Because it has like glitter on the sand dollar. So cute. That can go on a tiered tray for just like the summer months. Well, except July. So this can be up for like May 
in June because then July will be like patriotic. Oh my gosh. The seasons, the holidays, it's just too much. So next time I saw these, I thought these would be cute. Oh, where's the, oh, here it is. So this is the, I have the dish drying mats for like every season, every holiday. This one has the starfish. It's pretty blue and teal and gray and beachy. I love it. And I got the oven mitt. It says sea, sand, and sunshine. Super cute. Oh my gosh, I'm ready to get my kitchen in order. I need to get it in order and, so I can paint it and paint the cabinets. <laughs> so I got those. Let's see. Then they had these cute little decorator pillows that I thought would be cute for tear trays because they're so small. Um, so yeah, this one is white with the seahorses on it. Reminds me of at the zoo last summer with my dad and we were looking at the seahorses. They're so interesting. They're kind of creepy, but they're pretty, they're just, they're, they're so interesting to me. So there's that one with the seahorses. Then there's this one that just has coral on it. Super cute. And then there's this white one that has the starfish chocolate starfish in the hot dog flavored water oh my gosh i used to be obsessed with fred durst sorry i'm a limp biscuit fan and then this one is blue with the anchors these would be cute just tossed anywhere or on tiered trays like i said so cute so i got those let's see what is in here all right so in this bag oh there's glass so in this, um, it's so funny because since we went there, we've gotten some patio furniture for the front porch and it's like navy blue and I got decorator pillows like blue and gray. I didn't even think about that with this. I don't think I had it before this. I think I got this stuff first and then we just happened to stumble across patio furniture at one store is out of stock and I went to Walmart to check and see what they had just set for an idea of anybody having anything. Ended up getting the set that they had. But anyways, so here's just this little plate. It's the seashell like the holographic, whatever. It's probably not the right word, but there's a seashell bowl. And then they had these cute little jars that I got for tiered trays. You could put sand in them. You could put them outside and put sand in them, use them for like little ashtrays. Um, you could put candles in them. But look how cute, there's a blue and a teal with the starfish. They're so cute. I cannot wait to get my kitchen in order and decorate. Really train. Ugh. My battery's flashing, so I have to change my battery anyway. Perfect timing. <laughs> that might be a foreign sound to a lot of you in other states, but here in Ohio, uh, trains are everywhere. And we're so lucky to have a train track like a half a mile down the street. Jackson loves it. Absolutely loves it. He gets excited over every single train, no matter how many he sees in a day. All right, let me zoom you back out a little bit because I get a little bit close. Okay, so there were those little glass jars. Then they had these cute little buckets. So they have one that has, um, is it scratched up from being in the bag? Probably. Oh well. It's still like cute and like rustic. So this one has the seahorse on it. Cute little buckets for outside. You could put like a little planter in there. So I got the seahorse and I got the star. They have one that had a crab on it. Um, but I just picked up two. I thought these two were the cutest. So I got those two. Come over here, bucket. We don't want to block. We don't want to block the little pillows. <laughs> Okay, next step in here, I just have this little uh, wooden sign that says seize the day. This could go like on a tiered tray, on a shelf, on a mantle, wherever. Super cute. And like the border around here has coral on it. I don't know if you can see it. It's, I don't know, it's throwing it off because of the reflection on the metal. But there's that. Then I saw this. It's not 4th of July time, but how cute is this? It's the gnomes, you guys. Hooray, USA. This guy has sunglasses on. I had to. You know me and the gnomes. You know me and the gnomes. I don't need another cup. 
but I could not walk by these in the store and not get one. Oh my gosh, I love it. Plus I can mix up my crystal light in a water bottle and then pour it in here with some ice. I have my straw. See, I have a plan. As long as you have a plan, you're good. So there's that. And then I picked up these. I thought these were super cute to go with the whole beach theme. So I got this little tray that has the starfish and coral and sand dollars. Super pretty. Super pretty. Like you're outside grilling. You've got hot dogs and meat that are coming off. Put some, you know, put them on here. And then if you want to have like a big salad or like cut up some watermelon, I got this big giant bowl that has the starfish. I love this pattern. I think last year was like the corally and the greenish color, but I love this uh, bluish color. I think it's so pretty. Next up, we have this little bowl that has the coral and the starfish. I haven't even been watching Dollar Tree hauls to know what's been out there. I've like refrained from watching them because I don't need to find a reason to go. I've got too much going on, I have too much stuff as it is, I don't need anything. But I did want to look a little bit new um, decor for the new house. Now that the season changed, it's going to start getting warmer out. <gasps> Please don't be broken. I didn't like the sound of it. Yeah, the guy that bagged my stuff just kind of threw stuff in there. It's like it's glass, dude. Okay, so I got these, these little glass, um, Star, or yeah, starfish, super cute. Super cute. I'm trying to think, where is my glass jar with the candles in it? I usually put my starfish in like tissue paper because I do like the blue and coral. I don't know, I have no idea where it is. And then they had these little like starfish. Are these even called starfish? Because they're not like the big center. I mean, I think they are. There's like, there's like three in a little pack. What is it focusing on? So there you go. There are these three little... I thought I got sand dollars too. So I got two of those because they can like decorate like wherever. And then they had this bigger jar which I thought was adorable. Oh, the bow came undone. This is the guy that was um, bagging all my stuff. He was just like throwing it in bags like, dude, that's glass. Come on now. He doesn't know. So here's this one. It's like a votive candle. How cute. With the, like the ribbon and the starfish. Or even like one of the um, battery operated candles. Or you could hang it somewhere. Super cute. I love it. My stomach's growling, sorry. All right, let's lay him down maybe. I thought I got sand dollars. I'm almost positive I got sand dollars. Where the heck would they be though? Cause they're not. I don't know. Anyways, and then since it's starting to get warmer out, I got some outdoor things for the kids. We got my trampoline like a week ago. It's been like in the back of the van for a week because it's been raining nonstop. But they had these. It says chalked chalk pencil. So it says draw, erase. It says it was sharpener inside. So it's a chalk stick. With the, the cram parts of the holder, there's a sharpener inside, and then it has an eraser. So you can round the sidewalk and erase it. I don't know. We'll have to see how that works. I don't like the fact that it has a sharpener. Hopefully, it can't cut their fingers. So yeah, one for each of them. Let's see if they can draw on the sidewalk and erase it. I don't know. I've never seen these before at Dollar Tree. It sounded interesting. So I got them each an outdoor chalk pencil. I guess it's called... And then for the sandbox, I need to get a couple more bags of sand. I got these big digger things that they can dig. They have like a handle. It's just like the claw part of like a 
what excavator is that what it's called? I don't know. So yeah, they're just to dig in the sand. So I got two of those. Adrian doesn't play in the sand box often, but she does sometimes. So I only got two. I'm gonna pick up two pacifiers. Jackson's been going to sleep without pacifiers, guys, but sometimes he's super whiny and cranky and he just wants one and he just whines nonstop till he gets one. So I grabbed two to keep like on hand, but he has been going to sleep without them. That's amazing. Because he is totally a pacifier and blankie boy. He's mainly a blankie boy. He's never without a blanket. Uh, next up, I got this little pack of sand toys. Um, there's 10 pieces in here for a dollar. So it's like the little molds for in the sand. But 10 of them? There's like a fish. Uh, what is that? Like a seahorse. A little mushroom looking thing. A dolphin. Like all kinds of stuff in here. So 10 pieces for a dollar you cannot beat that you can't I don't care if I said you cannot beat 10 pieces for a dollar of sand toys and then I just got two of these I already have one it's just like the little sifter Adrian likes to do stuff with like her gems and rocks so she can you know scoop stuff up and shake them out and find her gems and rocks um, and they each come with a shovel and a little rake so I just picked up two I'm pretty sure the blue ones outside that they've been playing with um, but the less they fight over sand toys the better for me and the neighbors I did pick up three of these. It's just like a little rake and shovel. How cute are the little handles? So when they're outside playing in the sandbox, um, they each have their own little shovel and rake. So yeah, that is everything I picked up. Um, hold on, because there's one place that those sand dollars might be. I'm almost positive I got them, hold on. Okay, I knew I got the sand dollars. Um, they were on a separate trip. I got three more pink, three more teal, and three more blue uh, bins with lids to get like their little stuff. Like Adrian has fidgets and slime and bracelet making stuff and rubber bands, like all these little things. Like I don't care if they have like a lot of little stuff as long as they're contained. Gosh, I'm so out of breath because I literally ran down the stairs and ran back up. Ali has like all of her little people. Jax has all like little cars. He has his action figure things. He has his Marvel characters. Like if they're just in bins with lids, you can stack them up or put, slide them under their beds. It's just, it's so handy. So yeah. Yeah. I got the sand dollars. One pack of the sand dollars. Um, so they're like the size of the palm of my hand. So I got those. Go with a little starfish. I'm trying to get things kind of situated around here. Um, and then I also grabbed just some of the glow sticks for when they're playing outside at night. Like I said, we got them a trampoline. We're gonna be putting up. They can be jumping on the trampoline. They can have glow sticks bouncing around. Um, or if we go on walks when it's dark out, or just playing outside. So I just grabbed it because I don't, I'm sure we have some from the other house, but I have no idea where they're at. This is how things accumulate when you can't find what you have. That's why I'm going through one room at a time, organizing. I have so much stuff I'm getting rid of, you guys. Like half of my garage is full of stuff to get rid of. And we just had community garage sales. I didn't know about until Wednesday, and they were Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and it rained all three days. So I don't think it was a very big hit for our town. But I literally have like half a garage full of stuff to get rid of. So no, I'm not a hoarder. Hoarders don't get rid of stuff. I get rid of stuff and I'm getting rid of tons. I can't wait to start going through like my makeup stuff because there's so much I need to throw away because it's old. So anyways, I did get some glow sticks. And that is everything that I picked up um, at Dollar Tree. See, I'm trying to put these little starfish up somewhere. You can't really, okay. Trying to prop them up somewhere, but yeah, that's everything from my Dollar Tree haul. So yeah, I thank you so much for watching. Um, so yeah, I thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you've picked up any of these uh, summer items. If so, what did you get? And yeah, I thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.